In this tutorial, we will learn laws of exponents. Like us and subscribe and let's get started. Uh, first of all, the first law of exponent is the power of the product of factors is equal to the product of powers of each separate factors. For example, assume we have 2 times 3 times 4 times, say, 77, and this all is to the power of 5, then uh, this power of multiplication is a multiplication of powers. It will be 2 to the power of 5 times 3 to the power of 5 times 4 to the power of 5 and time 77 to the power of 5. A general formula is written as say we say uh, say we have um, numbers a times b times c times and so on. We assume that a, b and c are numbers and this is to the power of n in this case, this is equal to a to the power of n times b to the power of n times c to the power of n times and so on. This is a general formula. And let's assume uh, one more example. Assume we have um, x, x minus a times x plus b times x minus c and this everything to the power of to the power of 3 in this case these three factors uh, and using previous rule we will have x minus r a to the power of 3 times x plus b to the power of 3 times x minus c to the power of 3. And this was first rule. And of course, um, a reverse, uh, a reverse is also uh, valid. For, for example, uh, first of all, let's rewrite this formula. We, we can uh, reverse this formula and write that a to the power of n times b to the power of n c to the power of n and so on this is equal to a times b times c times and so on to the power of n this is the same formula but we changed uh, the places changed right place and left place and example will be, assume we have 1 over 3 to the power of 5 times 2 over 7 to the power of 5 times 4 over 9 to the power of 5. In this case, we can combine factors and have 1 over 3 times 2 over 7 times 4 over 9 and this everything to the power of 5 and we used at least this previous formula um, let's give the next rule it was rule number one uh, next rule number two will be A divided by B to the power of N. This is A to the power of N divided by B to the power of N. Or the power of a fraction is equal to the fraction obtained by dividing the same power of dividend by the same power of divisor. This is the main formula and reverse 
of this formula is also true. Uh, let's give examples. First example, assume we have 4 over 5 to the power of 3. This will be 4 to the power of 3 uh, divided by 5 to the power of 3. Or 2 over 3 to the power of 4 is equal to 2 to the power 4 times 3 to the power 4, um, which is 16 over 81. Um, another example, assume we have a plus x divided by b plus x and this everything to the power of 5. Using previous formula, this is a plus x to the power of 5 uh, over b plus x to the power of 5. Uh, let's use another uh, formula. This is the same formula, but inverse version of this formula. Uh, a to the power of n divided by b to the power of n. This is a over b to the power of n. Using this formula, um, we can solve an example. Assume we have 4 over 5 to the power 5 times 3 or 8 to the power of 5. And this will be using our formula. This will be 4 over 5 times 3 over 8 and this everything to the power of 5. We can perform cancellations here. Uh, this will be 1 and here we will have 2 and this is 3 over 5 times 2 or 10 to the power 5. Next um, law or rule for exponent rule number 3 is when multiplying powers with the same base, add exponents. Assume we multiply powers with the same base. In this case, a and a are the same, so the base is the same. In this case, we just add exponents. So, a to the power of m times a to the power n will be a to the power m plus n. We just add exponents. For example, um, 2 to the power 3 times 2 to the power 2 will be 2 to the power 3 plus 2, which is 2 to the power 5, or 32. Um, another example, x plus b to the power 3 times just x plus b. In this case, it will be equal to x plus b and power will be 3 plus 1 or x plus b to the power 4. Next law, law number 4, is in dividing powers, having the same base, subtract, subtract the exponents. Assume we have a to the power m divided by a to the power n. This will be a to the power m minus n. So when we had multiplication, we add. And when we had division, we have to subtract. And this is the main formula. Um, examples are, assume we have 7 to the power 5 divided by 7 to the power 3. Or in other form, this will be 7 to the power 5 
over 7 to the power 3. This is equal using uh, previous formula to 7 to the power 5 minus 3 or 7 to the power 2, 7 squared, which is 49. Another example, x plus y to the power 3 divided by x plus y to the power 2. In other form, it will be x plus y to the power 3 over x plus y to the power 2. This is x plus y to the power 3 minus 2 or this is just x plus y to the power 1, which is just x plus y. And next law, law number 5, is 